rest. Anytime I have a pen, we're gonna click it. I am Elena, this is my channel, Elena Drinks Beer. But today, we are not gonna be drinking beer. Today, I had an idea up here. And I think it's a good idea. I am going to go try foods that I hate and see if I now like them. Because some of these foods are foods I haven't consumed since I was a child, or at least for like a very long time. So that's what we're gonna do today. But first I have to like brainstorm a list <laughs> of foods that I don't like. And I have three already, so I brought my notebook. So we can make a list. I might need to like Google something at some point because I really, like I like most, things? I don't know. I could only come up with three, but I know that I should probably have more than that anyway. I don't know if you can see that. Foods I don't like. So the number one food that I hate is cantaloupe. I hate cantaloupe. I think it's disgusting. I think it smells like garbage and it's always one of those filler fruits. So anytime that you like go out and you buy like a fruit cup at like IHOP or whatever for breakfast or like, you know, whatever, there's always cantaloupe in there. And I think it's because it's cheap. And so like they skimp on the berries and the kiwi and like the stuff people actually like and they like fill with like honeydew or cantaloupe or something that's just like whatever. And it just has such a pervasive taste that then like infects everything that it touches. I can't even eat like anything else in the fruit cup. We're gonna give it another try because it's been a while and like maybe it's good. I don't know. The other food that I thought about that I really don't like is deviled eggs. I hate deviled eggs. I, I don't really get them and I don't think I'm gonna be able to buy them somewhere so I'm probably going to have to make deviled eggs or I'm probably just going to make a single deviled egg so I think I know like what's in it. I feel like you take the yolk out and you mix it with like what? Like probably mayo, mustard, like paprika. So I think I have all that stuff. I don't know, we'll figure it out together. <laughs> and then the third food that I already thought of that I really don't like. Oh yeah, sweet potato fries. I don't like sweet potato fries. I don't really understand them either in a similar way to deviled eggs. Like deviled eggs, I'd rather have it eggs any other way. Same with sweet potato fries. Like why wouldn't you just eat normal fries? They're never really all that crispy. They're not really that sweet, but they're also not savory. They're just sort of like a weird in between. They're almost always crinkle cut and crinkle cut fries are the worst. But I have an air fryer. So I think we can do the sweet potatoes in the air fryer. They might actually be good. But now I need to come up with more than just three. Let's put on the list beets. I don't really like beets, but I've never tried beets roasted in the oven. And roasting things in the oven really changes their kind of flavor a little bit. So I think that beets in the oven maybe could be good. Let's see what Google says are like commonly disliked foods and I'll see if I dislike any of those. Coriander, no, I love it. Brussels sprouts, I love. Cottage cheese, I love. Candy corn, I love. Eggplant, I love. Licorice, I love. Liver, I've had liver before, but I don't really remember it, but I also don't feel like finding liver today because I just kind of want to go to Target because I need to get other stuff there. Mushroom, um, I like mushrooms. Oh, I love circus peanuts. People don't like circus peanuts. Pickled cucumber, so pickles. Blue cheese, I like. Olives, I like. Pineapple, I like. Hawaiian pizza, I love. Spam, I like. Tuna's fine. Mayonnaise, matcha, oyster, chipotle. Ooh, I don't really like chipotle. Let's add that to the list. Maybe I can find like a chipotle salsa or something like that. Broccoli, I like. Sour cream, pizza, avocado, celery, tuna salad. Love it. Miracle Whip, I have no problem with it. Baked beans. Fine, I lo actually love baked beans. Shellfish, fine. Fish as food. I pretty much like all of those. I don't really like tomatoes. Maybe I can try a new kind of tomato. I don't like a grape or a cherry or something like that. What else don't I like? I don't know, I can't think of anything else. So maybe we should just go to the store and like wander around and maybe I'll see some more stuff and then I'll come home and I'm gonna try these foods. I don't know, I, yeah. All right, so we have our list and we are at Target. So Target kind of sucked. There were way too many people there and they really didn't have anything I needed. So I'm gonna have to go to Trader Joe's, which I didn't want to do, uh, but I know that they will have 
probably the rest of the stuff I need. But there is a plus, and I am glad that I went to Target because I decided to do something else that wasn't on my list, which is corn pops. I hate corn pops, they are the worst cereal. Fight me. Corn pops, I used to eat like this specific like eight pack of cereal sometimes when I was a kid over the summer, like home from school, my mom would get them. And I would always save the corn pops for last because they're gross. So, I just worked an eight hour shift, so I'm starving which may skew my kind of viewpoint on this stuff. Like I feel like I may end up liking it more just because I'm really hungry. I had to go to Trader Joe's and while I was there, I did think of one more thing that I really hate and that is a smoothie. I don't own a blender because I hate smoothies. I'm like, I don't really need a blender for anything else. Like I'm not doing like a lot of sauce work or anything like that. So I just bought a pre-made smoothie. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start with the Cheez-Its because they're gonna be my appetizer. We're gonna move on to the the deviled eggs, sweet potato fries and beets, and then we'll finish with like the sweet stuff, although I don't know if cantaloupe is really sweet. Anyway, Cheez-Its. Mm, I just don't really think that they taste like cheese, but I do like that the Cheez-Its have like a nice air bubble to them. You can pretty much like bite it in half and that's kind of cool. And also they're kind of burnt. I would say that I like this better than I remember and I probably will eat them, but they're really just like a three out of five. Cheez-Its, never gonna be my first choice. I don't know why this grosses me out so much. I realize it's just kind of like a deconstructed egg salad or it's an egg salad a deconstructed deviled egg, I don't know. But um, I yeah, I'm just not excited. Okay. It's actually kind of good. Mm. Okay. Maybe I'll finish it. I would actually say this deviled egg is four out of five. Only because we kind of have like leftover pieces. I'm worried that my beets got a little burnt. Everything I read online said to cook them for 50 minutes. That seems way too long. Daisy, you don't want this. I just used olive oil, salt, and pepper, so. I actually think roasted beets might be the worst version of beets I've ever had. And that's like a, like a one out of five, not good. Let's chase it down with a sweet potato fry. This is actually not bad. I think what made these sweet potato fries good is that I used the air fryer. So I made these in the air fryer, 400 degrees. Just the ends started to get burnt, which is I think a good thing. Still though, I don't know if I would ever pick a sweet potato fry over a regular fry. So I'm gonna go ahead and give it just a three out of five. Oh, okay. I need a drink, so let's try the smoothie. I got a banana almond butter protein smoothie beverage with coconut water and pea protein. I'm not sure that I'm gonna hate this one as much as I hate normal smoothies because it is from a store and so like I should have gone to like Juice Land or something like that where they would make a real smoothie because really the thing that I hate about smoothies is the texture. I don't like that thick texture. It's the same reason I don't really love bananas or mashed potatoes. I like those things. They, they definitely aren't a hated food. Like there's no place for them on this table right now. However, yeah, there's just something about that texture where you're, you don't know if you should chew it or not, that it just like rubs me the wrong way. This smells gross. All right. Ugh, this doesn't have the thick kind of texture to it that a normal like homemade smoothie would have. However, this has like a gritty texture from the pea protein, I'm guessing. I just don't like banana that much. This is like a two out of five. Next are corn pops. This is so funny because I brought these home and Zach loves corn pops. I just don't really, I don't really get it, but I'm gonna go grab a bowl and a spoon and some milk and I'll be back. Okay, corn pops. These taste very different than I remember. For one, they're not nearly as hard. And did some kid somewhere get like really hurt and their mom wrote an email or had a lawsuit and now they're softer? They definitely have an aftertaste of like old person home, if you know what I mean. But they're better than I remembered. I guess they're like a three out of five. Okay. And finally, we have cantaloupe, which is 
truly my most hated food. I can already smell it. It's just, I don't understand why people eat this I might gag. It's just not, it's just not my thing. It's so gross. Um, definitely a no-go on the cantaloupe. Zero to five stars. It's just not my thing. Ugh. Even after all this time, it's not my thing. There's just like a quality to it. There's like a taste to it that is so off-putting to me. I taste it in cantaloupe, tomatoes, and persimmons, which are all three things that I don't really like. Well, I hate cantaloupe. The other two, I mean, when do you really encounter a persimmon like out in the world? Unless you're seeking a persimmon out, you're never gonna just like have to deal with one. I guess that's this. Uh, highlights, probably Cheez-Its. Um, actually not as bad as I remembered. Deviled eggs, big surprise. I will now eat them at holiday parties. And um, yeah, cantaloupe still sucks. So thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, let me know and uh, I'll do more stuff like this. It's kind of different, but I have a few things like this planned and I think it could be fun. But yeah, I hope you're doing well, staying safe, staying healthy. I hope that you're having a great 2021 so far and uh, see you next week.